this thing still work? Hey guys, remember me? Hey guys, I can't even begin to explain how good it feels to finally be making videos again. For those of you that uh, have hung around forever, you realize that uh, it's been over two years since I've posted a video, and I appreciate you hanging around. For those of you that are new, uh, my name is Mike, uh, and this is the Moto Mule YouTube channel, and uh, in this video, I'm going to explain a little bit what we're about. First of all, Moto Mule is the name of a small business that I run. I primarily manufacture parts for dual sport motorcycles. Parts that turn motorcycles into pack mules. Hence the name Moto Mule. I will sometimes post videos that showcase the parts that I make or provide instructions on how to install them. But by far my favorite type of content to create are videos that showcase building one-of-a-kind vehicles, especially if these project vehicles allow me to get my kids involved. It is super important to me that I expose my boys to hands-on activities that challenge them to learn new skills or at least open their minds to new possibilities. It is my hope that my videos will also encourage you to do the same. I have tried to get my boys involved in shop activities since they were very young. As they grow, I hope they continue to be excited about learning new skills. I don't necessarily want them to be shop workers when they grow up, but the exposure now should only benefit them in whatever they decide to do as adults. That end part was pretty good. I was starting to go slower. Yeah? Yeah. Right at the end, I was starting to go slower. A bit slower. Dude, that looks a lot better. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are both doing great for yeah, as little time as you've well. We also like to get outside. So in addition to workshop videos, we'll share some of our adventures with you here on the Moto Mule YouTube channel. During the spring and summer, we love to ride our motorized toys. We frequent the sand dunes at the coast near to where we live. We also rip it up in the woods on our dirt bikes. When the weather turns cold, we venture out in our Jeep and explore on foot. Sometimes the cold weather really is a pain, so we turn to adventures indoors. We really enjoy radio controlled vehicles in the wintertime. <laughs> we may not be very good at driving them yet. But we're learning. We have some old projects to finish up, and we have plenty of new projects to show you. So, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button now. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up button. Thank you for watching. <laughs>